bonjour. Welcome back to the channel. I have been in Paris for now, how many days? Seven days? Seven. Seven days. Beautiful, beautiful city. Um, me and my girlfriend have been doing tons of shopping and I've come across tons of goodies and I wanted to do a review and show you guys one of them and I'm going to do another video and show a couple other things. But first off, we're going to start with this goodie right here. So. I happened to walk into one of the many Louis Vuittons out here in Paris and I was curious to see if they even had this pair in stock and I was in luck and they had one pair left and I guess they were on hold for somebody and they never came to pick them up so I got super lucky so let's get into it so as you can see and tell probably from the title of the video Gonna be the Millionaire 1.1 sunglasses. So they come in like the standard LV box, and kind of close to the Pharrell design ones from way back when, when I was growing up. The the old ones came in this box that was wooden and kind of looked like a trunk almost. And this one is, I guess, like the new rendition, Virgil's rendition of it, um, in a leather case and it kind of looks like an LV trunk if you look at the details you can kind of see like what's supposed to be the metal pieces on the trunk comes with like standard paperwork for the sunglasses just telling you how you should care for them all right so you crack that open and there they are the black model which is probably in my opinion the best model and hardest pair to get out of all of them so just like the old Millionaire Shades, they have the 24 karat gold detailing all throughout the sunglass with the monogram print. Let me see if it can focus. All throughout the shade. They're just like, I guess the difference from this pair to Pharrell's pair from back in the day is that um, Pharrell's pair was more based on uh, aviator style shade um, and this pair is based on like a wafer shade so I guess that's the difference but um, overall it still has the script detailing on the inside like the old ones did right here on this side a closer so you can see in gold um, still the same weight I remember um, I felt a pair back in the day and they were just extremely, extremely heavy. Um, super cool shades when you have them on, but they're just kind of heavy, I guess, since there's so much, um, so much metal and hardware on the actual frame itself. But um, they're crazy. Like even on the side detailing, it has black enamel with the gold detailing with the LV. Um, another like trunk piece over here. And then, yeah, so let's throw these on so you guys can see what they look like. So it's just like an oversized wafer, but an LV Millionaire wafer. So overall, I originally picked them up just because I felt like long term it'd be like an investment piece. But as I've been wearing them, I kind of think they're pretty sick out of everything that Virgil did. So definitely feel like it was a good purchase i got them for how much did i pay do you remember uh, it was like euros? it was like 690 euros um and then you get like the the vat the vat back um so like what's that in usd roughly all right she's finding out for us um, but way less in the states way less than excuse me than in the states in the states these shades are sold out in black um, And every other color In the states these shades are like going for over like a thousand and then resale is like 2,000 I've seen pairs sell sell at 3,000 so they're gonna go keep going up They're gonna hold their value at that. But yeah over here after you convert before before VAT, right? Yeah before VAT, it was like 
when converted it's like 700 and change usd and then after that it's like 600 and change usd so it's like i got like the craziest steal and yeah so like if i wanted to sell them i'm gonna make money if i keep them i got them at like the crazy come up price so that's only one of the pickups i did while i was out here um so let me guys know what you guys think about them if you prefer the original millionaires if you like these um drop a comment let me know what you think subscribe and check me out in the next video that i'm gonna do right now later guys